Hello Lake County, it's the Lake County Flash for Friday, August 19th, 2022. Here is your video news source for everything Oregon Outback, it's the Flash. A calf seen being attacked by two wolves in the Winter Rim area of Lake County was later found dead. The Oregon Department of Fish and Wildlife said that on the morning of Sunday, August 14th, a motorist saw a calf being attacked and scared away the wolves. Later that day, a livestock producer found the dead 500-pound, five-month-old calf on a public land grazing allotment. The depredation is attributed to the LAS-13 and OR-115 wolves. According to the report, the severity, size, and location of the wounds are consistent with injuries to cattle attacked by wolves. That area of known wolf activity, or aqua, runs east of Fort Klamath past Beatty and north of Shemult, south toward Klamath Falls. In 2012, fifth grader Rowdy Gerber placed second in the Lakeview BLM poster contest. He drew a poster of a fish in the water saying, I'd rather breathe air. And just like that, he discovered that when he grew up, he wanted to teach people. Rowdy shared that working for the BLM was a dream inspired by the park rangers who came and taught his class about the importance of public lands back when he was in fifth grade. At age 17, Rowdy got his first seasonal government job as a recreation technician with the Fremont Wynema National Forest. Now 21, Rowdy's fourth BLM seasonal job is ending. On August 24th, he will start as a special education teacher at the Lakeview Elementary Schools. Lakeview District Manager Todd Forbes said the BLM Lakeview District team wishes Rowdy the best as he embarks on his new journey. The Oregon Department of Fish and Wildlife will host public meetings in Lakeview and Klamath Falls on Wednesday, August 24th and Thursday, August 25th to outline plans to remove brown bullhead and fathead minnows from Hart Lake to improve the trout fishery. The August 24th meeting in Lakeview will begin at 6 p.m. at the ODFW office at 18560 Roberta Road. The August 25th meeting in Klamath Falls is set for 6 p.m. at the Klamath County Fairgrounds Linman Hall. At both meetings, ODF staff will describe plans to treat Hart Lake with rotenone in September to remove illegally introduced brown bullhead and fathead minnows that are having a negative impact on the trout fishery. According to ODFW, rotenone was chosen for the treatment because it is an affordable and effective way to remove unwanted fish with little threat of long-term ecological damage. The boards of Pacific Crest Federal Credit Union and Klamath Public Employees Federal Credit Union recently voted on resolutions of intent to merge. The merger will be subject to a lengthy regulatory process that includes a vote by the membership of Klamath Public Employees Federal Credit Union. Under the planned merger, members of both credit unions will benefit from an anticipated expansion of services and an expanded number of branch locations, with the branches of both organizations remaining open after the merger. Kevin Deering, Klamath Public's CEO, pointed out, This merger is about doing what is best for our members and assuring that our region continues to have local decisions made by local people who live and work here. That does it for this week. Be sure to check out the online calendar to keep up with events happening around the county, catch a new flash every Friday, the Lake County Hotspot every Tuesday, and for these stories and much more, be sure to pick up a copy of the next Lake County Examiner. Stop in to Lakeview's Ace Hardware between now and August 30th for some red hot buys to help with your home project. Ace is the place for all your painting needs. The Ace Extra Mile Promise guarantees you'll get everything you need to paint in one trip or they'll deliver it free with a minimum paint purchase of one gallon. Also on special this month, select cleaning rags and shop towels are buy one get one free. And replace those old light bulbs with Fight Electric LED bulbs. A 10 pack is just $9.99. Ace is open seven days a week to help with all your home project needs, so stop in today. And remember, Ace is the place with the helpful hardware folks.